Well, good morning, beautiful people. Good morning, beautiful people. Today, I am going to be doing a challenge brought to you courtesy of Auntie Maddie's TV. I'm going to tell you about the challenge, but first, I'm going to go ahead and prepare my tea because I think the secret to... Because you can't drink water. You can drink something. So the secret is, I believe, is to drink something warm. So we'll see how that goes. But I put my pot, courtesy of Blooming Tea Garden. So if you can see this. And these are actually flower pots, tea flower pots. <clears throat> And you put it in hot water and you prepare in your uh, teacup for that. And it's going to bloom into a flower. But I had some earlier, so I have some little warm tea. I also have my timer. I'm going to go ahead and tell you what this entails. This challenge is the three boiled egg challenge. And what you have to do is eat the three boiled eggs. You have five minutes to do it. No hands. All right. Reminder that it is Heart Health Month. February is Heart Health Month. So. I'm going to say my grace. And then. I hope you all can see that. I don't know because of the light. You may not be able to see it. But. I'm going to have my timer up there. Amen. So, I have five minutes to do this. Now, Auntie Maddie TV, I have seen other people do this challenge. And they've, do they've done it in less than five minutes. Okay? So... <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and attempt to do it. You all see how that's blooming? I'll show you it by the time I'm finished, okay? Okay, so we're going to start.
See how that flower is blooming? Can you all see that? 347. Three minutes and 47 seconds. Wow. I'm going to tell you, <coughs> excuse me. The eggs were a little cold, but that's okay. But like I said before I did the challenge, I think the key is to um, do something warm so it'll go down much easier instead of having something cold to drink. But let me tell y'all something. <laughs> I see that, you, that uh, people are doing that chip challenge, that black chip. Well, Dre, what is it? Dre, Dre underscore OG704. He decided that he wanted to do the challenge and he was calling out YouTubers. <laughs> I am subscribed to your channel, brother. And I tell you, it's the funniest thing. You all should go and check him out. What he's doing is he decided to do the black chip challenge with the spicy noodle challenge and buffalo wild wings <laughs> challenge. Okay. So he said, yeah, y'all, I'm going to do this. And I'm going to, uh, before I even start, I'm going to call out uh, he was calling out some YouTubers. He called out Matt Stoney. He called out Beloved's Like He was calling out different people, right? And, um, so, again, he had the black chip, the noodles. He had put the, everything on there. And then he had the, um, um, what, gosh, the, the, the chips, the noodles, and the Buffalo Wild Wings, whatever their real spicy wings are. Okay, you all have to see this. This YouTube, I tell you, this is hilarious. It's so hilarious because he says, okay, for the for this, I'm going to go ahead and put my gloves on for the, um, do the chip first. So he went and he did the chip, y'all. He put his gloves on. He did the chip. He's sitting there. And I guess one of his boys is, is filming him. And he looks like he's about to cry. And that's actually what one of his friends is telling me. This way he's about to cry. And he's like, oh. Oh. It was so hot to him, y'all. He didn't know what to do. He was pacing around. Then he decides to go into the bathroom. He sits in the bathtub uh, with his clothes on. And he turns the water on. So he just start drinking some water and then shooting it out. 
<laughs> like a humpback whale. <laughs> and it's so funny. But he's like, I don't know. He just don't know what to do. And he says, abandon ship, abandon ship. Because <laughs> he's done. But it is hilarious. Dre, uh, Dre underscore OG704. Brother, your video was hilarious. I, it actually made my day. And see you all. Here's the flat. Let me let me see if I can um let me grasp this better. Grab this better. So you all see the flower? Can you see the flower? Look at that. Isn't that pretty? And um they have different before I bought the box. I bought um, the singles, and they are detox also on uh, teas like chamomile, lavender, detox. But the one I have in here is the green tea, and it's a rose flower, the green tea rose flower, and I just love it. And again, this month is Heart Health Month, so and those eggs with the yolks, but. I can still do it. I can do that challenge, you know. I'm not, you know, I'm okay. But I had some chamomile a little earlier, a little chamomile tea. But like I say, this is the garden tea uh, rose flavor. And I just absolutely love it, y'all. Sometimes if I've had, um, I like those little oatmeal brown sugar oatmeal um you just put some water in and, and let it sit for a few minutes and it you don't need any sugar honey you don't need anything and speaking of honey and teas because i do i love teas and uh, tea and hot chocolates i'm a tea and hot chocolate drinker and um this is the honey that i use to put on my toast to put on my um, uh, yeah, to put on my toes, to put in my teas. That's the um, type of honey that I use, the raw honey. That was a fun challenge, though. Some of my friends that have been watching my channel, a couple of them made uh, remarks that, uh, oh, so you just be over there eating and don't invite anyone. Know that you are invited. Know that you are invited <laughs> anytime to come and eat with me. I welcome it. So, and this is actually also a strainer that goes in this teapot. But this is awesome, y'all. I love it, love it, love it. And you know the fragrance? I'm going to tell you what it smells like. You can smell the rose. You can smell the rose flavor. Mm -hmm. You can smell that aroma in there. Mm -hmm. And it's so soothing. You can smell a lot of the rose and taste the rose. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I'm kind of um, going, going through this video trying to make it a little longer so at least it's at least 10 minutes long but um anyway stop please go and watch check out dre og uh og 704 check out the challenge that he did trying to do the 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 chip the noodles and the um buffalo wild wings <coughs> excuse me <clears throat> go and check out that challenge and no i don't have not a sponsor of the blooming teas, but I do um, enjoy them. I'm gonna have some raisin bread toast and 
some tea. Very good. Very good. And uh, uh, again, the thing of it is, is to put, um, drink something warm when you're doing all that, you know, those kind of challenges that has to do with food. If you drink a little something warm, then it'll go down a little faster. Better. That's a tip. I hope you all enjoyed my videos. And I want to thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for rocking with me. For all of you all that's rocking with me, whether you started day one, in the middle, or in the end, it doesn't matter. I thank you for rocking with me. And when you're watching the uh, videos, please make sure you watch the entire video. If you don't, you're not able to watch the entire video, just let it run. And go ahead and continue to, sipping your tea. All right? But this is courtesy of, I think, I, I believe I got these from Way, Wayfair. And they come in different types of uh, tea kettles and stuff. Different styles, I should say. And. Gotta love it. Uh, I tell you, this is, tea is very soothing. I just love it. I'm going to go enjoy my tea, the rest of my tea, the rest of this pot. Again, these are Blow Me Teas, and they come in all different uh, flavors. As you can see, this is the Rose. This is the Rose Tea. Also, they come in Detox, diff different uh, flavors of Detox. So, different flavors of Detox. And last, again, this is to get a gift box if you are a lover of them like I am if you want to try them I believe I got this at Wayfair but you know Amazon they carry it as well as Overstock and thank you all again for watching the video you saw my time a little over three minutes so you all have a blessed day and make sure that you're good to yourself Make sure that you're good to others.